So there may come a time where you need to manually delete a MySQL database or potentially delete a MySQL table from your database. So realistically, you've got two options. You can delete the entire database itself, or you can delete individual tables directly from that database. So it's actually super easy to accomplish when you're using PHP MyAdmin. So once you've got PHP MyAdmin loaded up and you're selected to your database that you want to delete, you'll actually see a list of every single table you currently have in your database. Now, in order to delete the database table, you simply have to click on the drop button that's directly next to that table's row. So in this case, I've got this users table. So if I want to delete this users table, I can click the drop button. You'll get a pop-up, a confirmation message asking you, are you sure you want to delete this? In fact, PHP My Admin is actually using the drop table MySQL command in order to manually remove this database table for you. You'll get the confirmation saying, asking you if you do want to delete the table, go ahead and click OK. It'll process the request after a couple of seconds, and it'll tell you that your database table has been deleted. So now if you notice, if I click on the structure tab, you'll see no tables are found because that was the only table inside of this database. Now alternatively, if you want to delete the entire database itself from the server, you can do that too. Now, if you delete the entire database, it's going to delete all of the tables and all of the information stored inside of each one of those tables. So do be cautious if you are doing this. Now, there's two ways that you can actually delete your database table from PHP MyAdmin. The first one is being selected to the database itself, in this case, the course underscore MySQL database. You can go to the Operations tab, and then underneath the Operations tab, you'll, have, you'll see the Remove Database option and the drop database drop link itself. So if you want to delete the database, you can click on that, and then you'll get a confirmation pop-up asking you if, you're, if you are sure you want to delete it. And if you are, you can click the OK. If not, hit Cancel. Now the other option is if you go to the PHP MyAdmin homepage, you can select the Databases tab. And then from the Databases tab, you'll see a list of every single database you have on your server. And then you simply just have to hit the checkbox next to the database you're trying to delete. So if you're trying to delete multiple databases, you can do that easily here. So select that checkbox next to the database you want to delete, and then you just hit the drop button down there at the bottom. And again, you'll get the confirmation message asking you if you're sure, and if you are, you can click OK. And then it'll be deleted directly from your server itself. Now, every time you load up your databases, that database will be gone and that table will be gone, depending on which operation you used.